we took the occasion of this presentation by launching a 208 uh, seconds watch which is dedicated to the to Captain Sally. Captain Sally saved 155 lives in 208 seconds. The 208 second watch is a special limited edition timepiece and it commemorates the flight of flight 1549 in which we had as it turned out 3 minutes 28 seconds 208 seconds to solve a life-threatening crisis we'd never trained for, never seen before. And so at the end of that flight, when we had safely made an emergency landing the Hudson River and all 155 passengers and crew were safe, we thought that that was the most appropriate way to represent the preciousness of every moment of our lives and how even in a very short time period, amazing things can be accomplished. When we came ashore as wet cold passengers and on that winter day in January 2009, it was the American Red Cross who was there to meet us and gave us blankets from the American Red Cross. So a portion of the proceeds are going to be donated regionally to the local American Red Cross. The Rory Staunton Foundation is the other charity of my choice that's receiving proceeds from the 208 second watch. Rory Staunton was a 12 year old boy from New York who died unnecessarily of a medical accident from sepsis, a bloodstream infection, something that happens too often in this country. My connection with Roy Staunton is that he had read my first book, Highest Duty, and he was fascinated by the idea of having a career in flying as I had. And he was very fascinated with flying at a very early age as I had been. And when I learned of that, I contacted the family, met them, and I've tried to help them every way I could since. The watch is, uh, is an aeroscope. Aeroscope is in uh, full in titanium, full grade five, which is the highest uh, definition of titanium uh, for a watch. Uh, titanium is also very much related to aeronautics. I love how uniquely intuitive the design is. How they were able to graphically represent those 208 seconds on the face of the watch. What they have done is the designers have taken three white concentric circles to represent the first minute, the second minute, and the third minute that we had during that flight, and then a final red arc from the 12 o'clock position down to the 28th second, representing the final 28 seconds that we had to solve that problem that day. Mm -hmm. 